Hello guys, my name is Victoria Pavlov, I'm the Photoshop artist and today we will talk about mobile to desktop workflow. I will be using Adobe Capture CC, Adobe mobile application and I will be using Adobe Photoshop CC. Using Adobe Capture CC I will create very beautiful custom brush and I will use this brush in my workflow in Photoshop CC. Uh, it's November, it's beautiful color, beautiful mood. So let's use everything in our workflow. As you can see, I have uh, launched my um, Capture CC and I tapped on a brushes tab. On the bottom of my screen, we can see a very beautiful and magical plus sign. I will click on it and voila, I launched my camera. Um, using a slider um, in the, on the bottom of your uh, screen, you can uh, erase background and rotating your phone you can find the, a better angle for your brush after you will be satisfied with angle and everything just click and take picture of your um, object just like that now I can crop my brush I will make it bigger and I will rotate it just like that Just smaller, just like that, and I will click on Styles tab. Here I can specify for what application I would like to create my brush. For Adobe Sketch, for Photoshop CC in Adobe Sketch brushes, or for Illustrator CC, and this is awesome. Today I will create my brush for Photoshop CC and Adobe Sketch workflow. From our three choices, I will click on the third one, and I will click on Presets. Here I can specify size for my brush. I will make it can make it bigger or smaller. I will move my slider somewhere in the middle, and also I can specify minimum size for my brush, just like that. I can specify angle. Probably I will stay with uh, directional, and I will specify spacing for my brush. Uh, I specify spacing for fourteen percent, and now I can specify scatter, just like that. I will not touch anything else. I can modify my brush in Photoshop. I will click on Refine. Here, moving my slider, I can erase a background. I have also plus and minus sign, um, signs. Using minus sign, I will erase partial of my background. I don't need this part of this of my background, so I don't need this. And voila, it's gone. I'm happy with my brush absolutely happy I will click on save and now I will specify a um, name of my brush let's rename it tutorial and I specify a library I will save my library to my Adobe capture um, library I will click save and voila now guys I will open my uh, Adobe Photoshop CC and we will continue working on our project using our beautiful new brush we created in Adobe Capture CC. So guys, now I'm in Adobe Photoshop CC. I have created simple document and I will create a very beautiful um, and unique uh, uh, background for my um, autumn workflow. So. I will create a new layer and here I have opened my Adobe, my Adobe Capture CC library and as you can see I have here my new brush tutorial. We just created this brush using Adobe Capture CC. I will click on my brush. I will change color for my brush. It's autumn. It's supposed to be bright with uh, exceptional mood and everything like that so let's use this color I will click OK if I would like to change parameters for my brush I will click on my brushes and here I can specify anything I want to guys everything depends of uh, your preferences everything depends of your taste I'm just showing you um, some example what you can um, create using a mobile and desktop um, workflow I will increase size for my brush I will make it bigger and I will start creating my um, very beautiful autumn uh, wallpaper just like that I will create a new layer I will change color for my brush 
I will use more yellow now. And I will continue um, my uh, workflow using same brush, just like that. Very moody, very um, uh, fall, uh, <laughs> folly <laughs> or something like that. Now I will change color for my brush. I will use green color, just like that, maybe darker green. I will create a new layer and I will continue just like that. What I would like to do, I would like to bring down opacity for my green leaves layer. Just like that. And I will create a new layer. I will click on my um, brush setting and I will click on wet edges. Just like that. And using a red color. Just, just maybe something like that. Let's see. Yeah, I will apply create the last layer for my um, beautiful wallpaper. Just like that. I can bring my size down. Just like that. Beautiful. If you don't like this layer, simply delete this layer and you can start everything again. Just like that. So guys, this is what I would like, uh, what I wanted to share with you. This is a very beautiful and very unique uh, workflow from mobile to desktop. We used Adobe Capture CC, Adobe mobile application to create our custom autumn brush. We saved this brush in our Adobe Creative Cloud library. We opened Adobe Photoshop CC and we created very beautiful autumn wallpaper using our new custom brush. This is, guys, just an idea. No limitations. You can do anything you want to. Thank you, guys. And I will see you later. Bye.